Good afternoon, everybody. Two weeks ago, NASA made history once again. We conducted humanity's first planetary defense test. And after a 10-month journey, millions of miles, NASA successfully crashed a refrigerator-sized spacecraft into the asteroid Dimorphos, seven million miles from Earth, and it came in at 14,000 miles an hour, and it was a bullseye. And now the team has confirmed that the spacecraft's impact altered Dimorphos orbit around Didymos by 32 minutes and therefore successfully moved its trajectory. Now this is a watershed moment for planetary defense and a watershed moment for humanity. And that's why it was fitting that DART was an international endeavor. We started looking at those images. We, we couldn't believe our eyes that actually we made it. We've heard that the team has measured that the orbital period of Dimorphos has changed from a period of 11 hours and 55 minutes to a period of 11 hours and 23 minutes. That's a change of 32 minutes with a precision of plus or minus two minutes. It's within the range um, of the models that have been uh, studied, but it's also definitely indicating that you're getting an enhanced deflection due to the amount of ejecta, that rocky material that's being thrown off when DART's collision happened. And it just gave it a small nudge. But if you wanted to do this in the future, potentially, it could potentially work, but you'd want to do it years in advance. Warning time is really key here in order to enable this sort of asteroid deflection to potentially be used in the future as part of a much larger planetary defense strategy.